what's up guys it's your girl my Taylor Renee and I'm back once again with another video so as you can see by the title we are going to be talking about nipple piercings because I got mine done but before I start this video make sure you like comment subscribe turn on the post notification button and once you do that we are officially locked in okay so let's get into the story okay so y'all I had got my nipples pierced last year I had got my nipples pierced. I wish I would have recorded the video, but I'm about to tell y'all all about the nipple piercings and what y'all need to know before y'all get it done. Okay, so healing process, they say about six weeks, but I feel like mine is not healed. Mine aren't healed. But when I got it done, on a scale from one to 10, it was a three for me. But everybody can be different, but it was it didn't hurt that bad. Once they put the needle in, I screamed loud because I felt like when you, once you scream, I feel like it just helps with pain. But my pain tolerance was really high, so it was a 3 out of 10 for me. So, yeah, it wasn't that bad. Um, after I finished, they gave me some, uh, what's that called? They gave me the spray for, um, so I can spray on my nipples and, you know, like, I mean, nipple care products for my nipples um yeah so they gave me some spray so i can spray my nipples and clean them make sure i take care of them properly it takes six weeks for them to heal that's what they say um once i left um every time my nipples got cold or like i mean like some cold weather or a fan hit or like some cold air hit me my nipples get tender and I feel like once your nipples are tender, that's when it hurt the most because they're cold, you know, our nipples get hard. So that's one thing. It hurts around that time. Um, I slept perfectly fine. Like once you fall asleep, you won't feel the pain or whatever. Um, oh yeah, I did not mention this in the video, but once you get them done, once you get them pierced, I feel like that you should fall asleep before you go to bed make sure that you put on a sports bra and fall asleep with it because it'll have them in place so they won't move around they won't tug on anything once you fall asleep like if a sheet or you know like if a, your sheet got like a little string you know and it might like wrap around your nipple and then you wake up and get up fast and it tug and it come out so make sure you fall asleep with a sports bra on until you feel that they are healed and they don't hurt anymore okay okay what else should i share with you guys um some discharge may come from your nipples uh some discharge came from my nipples um like if i hit them or whatever like some discharge might come out but i never was in the position of like my shirt pulling on my um nipple piercing or anything so but yeah like if you like hit them on accident it is gonna cause a little pain but now i think it's been it'll be a year in august i believe or july so um they don't hurt they don't hurt at all like i can just squeeze my nipples um but they itch really bad like they itch sometimes i have to itch my nipple or around it like this but yeah um it wasn't a bad experience i feel like if you want to get yours done go ahead and get it because this is the this is your chance to go get your nipples done because it wasn't that bad so i feel like well i can't speak for everyone but me personally it wasn't bad at all just make sure you have someone there with you if you are afraid have a friend a cousin a sister hold your hand and just scream and look away but yeah it wasn't bad at all so i feel that you should get your nipples pierced um they look really cute in shirts that's why i got them done so like if i during the summertime like when i do pop out and start wearing some cute little tops my nipple piercings can show through them because i feel like that's cute and i can't wait to change them i have not changed them yet um i still have the same uh nipple piercing rings i had in when i first got them done and they're really small they come really small so yeah um the person that did mine 
I went to Body360, so the person that did mine, it was a female, and she did really good. Like, she just talked me through it. I was afraid, but I, you know what? I was like, you know what? I'm gonna just go ahead and do it. But it did hurt, like, for, like, the first couple of hours. But once you take a shower and let the warm water hit, you'll be fine. But, yeah, um... I'm gonna show y'all the bottle that they gave me for my nipples. This bottle, it costs about five extra dollars um, once you pay for your piercings. My piercings, I think they were $40 or $60. I think my nipple piercings was 60 or 40. Or, I'm, I'm not sure, I don't remember. Um, But yeah, it didn't hurt that bad. This, um. I was using it, but then I had some soap that had the same stuff inside of this on Amazon. So I was washing up with that and it like took away all the bacteria or whatever they say, like to prevent from it getting, you know, infected. So that's what I was using, tea tree oil soap. I mean, tea tree soap, that's what I was using for my nipples. So you can find that anywhere. I feel like you should order some tea tree soap online um because it definitely helped i used this maybe like in the beginning of me getting my nipples pierced but then i stopped using it but i think i'll start using it again just because i don't want nothing to happen to my nipples because i do have scabbing i did have scabbing on my nipples like on the sides you will have like if you hit it or bump it or whatever um scabs will appear on the sides and your skin will peel that's why it's like itchy and make sure you keep your nipples moisturized because it's gonna itch really bad um i heard other people say like they had like green discharge i never had green discharge on my nipples so but yeah just make sure you take care of them properly uh i advise you to wear sports bras that will help in the beginning so you know that they're placed correctly in your sports bra i would show like the outline of them but i got a sports bra on so can't see nothing really let me see hold on let's see see it's really small i can push it in and out but yeah that's what it looks like um, but yeah, guys, so if you want to go get your nipples pierced, go ahead and do it. I advise you to get them done because they are really cute. Um, I feel like it built my well, I you know, I'm confident already, but it built it up a little more. Like, once I take a shower and I get out and I have my belly button pierced and my so I just look in the mirror and I'll be like, ooh, girl, you sexy. That's how I be feeling. But yeah, so if you want to get them pierced, go ahead and get them pierced. So yeah, um, and like TMI, like during, you know, I feel like it's cute too. Like, ooh, if you like, I feel like once you get your nipples pierced, they're like more sensitive. So when somebody like something like if you okay. okay but yeah tmi but i'm just letting y'all know but yeah so go ahead and get that done uh yeah so this is basically a video on like what you need to know before you get your nipples pierced and the pros and cons but i feel like nothing is nothing bad i feel like you should go for it if you thought about it well and if you're looking at videos to know how it feel or whatever um this is the video right here three out of ten the pain tolerance well yeah mine was three out of ten so yeah um that's all i gotta say i don't think i have anything else to say just make sure you take care of them correctly so you can avoid all those other issues but 
yeah make sure you like comment subscribe turn on the post notification button and once you do that we are officially locked in we are in the switch love okay <laughs> all right y'all